Archbishop McDonald High School's vision is to develop outstanding graduates who will serve their community with the highest of excellence. A unique Catholic high school with specialized academic programs complemented with outstanding athletic, music, and fine arts programs. Archbishop McDonald's mission is to encourage and celebrate the education and development of the whole person. MAC provides the opportunity for students to pursue special interests, explore their many talents, and form new friendships. On April 3rd, 1881, on a beautiful spring day in Maryvale, Nova Scotia, the McDonald family welcomed their newest member, John Hugh McDonald. With the salt of the sea air, wind at his back, and the foundations of East Coast hospitality, that little boy would never have guessed that his love of God would one day inspire a school on the other side of the country in Edmonton, Alberta. John Hugh McDonald would become the inspiration to the charism for the school that was named after him. May God bless our Mac community to have the hearts of the saints, to know God, to love God, and to serve God. Following his theological studies, at the age of 25, John's desire to know God led him to become ordained a priest in Antigonish, Nova Scotia. Known now as Father John, he grew with the communities of Nova Scotia, learning to fine-tune his faith and reason. To know God, he studied God in the communities he served. Deepening his knowledge of God led him from the East Coast to the West Coast, where he became the Bishop of Victoria in 1934. But with the salty water of the sea in his veins, another calling to know God was in the plans. In 1938, Bishop MacDonald found himself called to become a prairie boy, where he became Archbishop of Edmonton, where he continued his relationship to know God, introducing strong programs supporting adult education in Edmonton. After 26 years as the leader of the Archdiocese, MacDonald retired in 1964 with the well-established reputation in a nickname the educator. To truly know God can only lead one to love God, and Archbishop MacDonald loved God. The symbolism of his coat of arms shows this love. The Sacred Heart found in the bottom right corner was not only in memory of Sacred Heart Parish in Sydney, Nova Scotia, where he labored for 10 years, but showed his deep love for Christ. The Sacred Heart is the heart of Christ pierced on the cross. It is on the cross we see the greatest act of God's love. The cross is where Archbishop MacDonald loved God, no more evident than in his motto, Hail to the cross, our only hope. To know God leads one to love God, and to love God leads one to serve God, and serve Archbishop MacDonald did. While serving as a parish priest, he grew to respect the Nova Scotia coal miners and the working class people. His courage and selflessness was demonstrated during a fatal Cape Breton mine explosion when at personal risk, Father John entered the mine to minister to the dying miners. Living through the Great Depression and understanding the devastating impact of poverty, Archbishop MacDonald set about guaranteeing that people would never suffer again as they had during the Depression by establishing credit unions in Alberta and strongly supporting adult education. Known for his work in eliminating discrimination, Archbishop MacDonald also established the foundation of Catholic Social Services in Edmonton. Today we find that the charism inspired by our school's namesake is alive and well, 
and on this day, April 3rd, the birthday of Archbishop MacDonald, we ask to be blessed to have the hearts of the saints, to know God, to love God, and to serve God. Amen. Please join in singing Happy Birthday to our school's namesake, Archbishop John Hugh MacDonald. <laughs> 